independent review panel was set to look into the partial collapse of the married inspector's quarters building at the Sunday station back in May. The panel concluded that there were three likely causes. The first, increased stress put onto the columns of the collapsed wall. The panel said the west corp that was annexed to one of the collapsed wall was supported by temporary steel support while excavation work was carried out at its base. It's believed the support was deflected, and as a result, the West Corporal put more pressure on the adjacent brick columns of the North Wall, which collapsed. Second, as part of the timber floor strengthening and fire resistance works of the first floor, holes were drilled into the North Wall, with some being very close to the base columns. The believes this was the immediate cause of collapse. The panel added the third cause of the collapse was cracks or weak bonding in the brick columns in the north wall that went unnoticed. The cracks spread during the whole excavation and eventually led to the collapse. The panel suggests measures that could prevent such incidents from happening. Firstly, uh, avoid making the holes in the columns. The other is that uh, the short of the arches and the short of the floor while you are doing the uh, excavation, because the, the props are all supporting the arches and the, and the floor, so the, the column is not uh, required to take as much load. So even you, for, for a short period of time, a day or two days, you make the excavation, uh, the, the column can stand that kind of uh, uh, cutting. The panel was also asked who should be held responsible for the incident and whether it was a human error. Wong said they are only responsible for finding out the causes, not liability.